Hi ladies. It's time for another video. I have gotten numerous requests to do a video on eye pigments and those of you that know me well must find this pretty ridiculous and hilarious at the same time because I really am not a makeup girl. I mean I love makeup and I think it's fun but no one has ever really taught me how to put makeup on. No one comes to me for makeup advice. Um, so I backed away from doing this video for a little bit, but now I feel um, like I've gotten a little bit of training and a little bit more confident about what I'm doing. So I want to show you what I pretty much wear almost every day. Um, it has been ridiculously hot and humid. I'm wearing the hot and humid hairstyle, you can see. But the eye pigments have lasted all day, which is amazing. Like no creases in the eyes from sweat. Um, it doesn't rub off, run off or um, fade. It's been amazing. So. I'm going to show you what I do. Um, I take one brush, like the, it's like a, a wider edge brush, and I'm going to take Curious, which is a lighter color, and I'm going to put it over the my entire eyelid. I've already put eye primer on, um, which is a must because I've learned that it just makes your, not only does it make it last, but it just makes it brighter too. And I'm using the shimmer um, eye pigments just because I'm a shimmer girl but I love the mattes as well too. Okay, so that's done. Then I'm gonna take the crease brush and I'm gonna dip it in Confident, which is a darker brown, kind of a coppery color. And what I'm gonna do is just dot the crease of my eye. Just like that. And then I'm gonna take a fading brush shading brush, whatever. I don't know what they're called. See, I don't know what I'm talking about. Why are you listening to me? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You want to listen to me. You want this. I promise. Because it's for people like me who don't know what they're doing. This stuff is awesome. Um, and then I'm going to take a little bit more of the Curious and blend up here. I feel like that painter guy on PBS who paints. Don't even know who I'm talking about. Um, then I'm going to take a little bit of gorgeous, which is like a um, gold color. I love gold. Love, love, love gold. Okay, and I'm going to put a little bit of that on my eyelid, just below where I put the dark color. Oh, that's my phone. Sorry, that's distracting. Okay, blend. And if you want, you know, a little bit darker, you can. I have a little tissue down here that I'm just like dabbing my brushes in. Um, putting, I love light above my, like next to my brow bone. I have ridiculous, I like the word ridiculous. If, if you, once you get to know me, you'll know that. But I have crazy eyebrows. Like people tell me all the time I look like Brooke Shields because my eyebrows are, which I don't really take as a compliment because I think her eyebrows are insane. But, um, okay. So there you have that. Now this is one of my favorite parts, the eyeliner. Um, you take an eyeliner brush dip it in a little bit of water. I just usually dip it in the bottom of my sink after I've used it. So you get that wet a little bit. And then uh, that's Daring. It's a much darker brown. And I just dip it in a little bit of that and then create an eyeliner, which this has seriously changed my life. Okay, that's dramatic. But It's made eye makeup more fun for me because it opens up so many more colors. And honestly, it's the easiest eyeliner I have found to put on. So there you go. And then, of course, you want to do your 3D lashes, which I'm not going to show you right now. Um, maybe if I shut this curtain a little bit. Oh, look how much better that is. Okay, um, so you can see just it's very natural. Um, with my 3D lashes, it'll be awesome. Go watch my 3D lashes video if you haven't seen that. Hopefully this has been a little helpful to you. Ask away, ask me questions if I don't know the answer. I will go find someone, but the pigments are a must. You're gonna love it so much. You're gonna wanna kiss me.